Can I shrink a scientist? Come on, get the scient- Oh! <gasps> I shrank the scientist's head! Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, this is Scrapman, bringing you a look at Modular Destruction Labs. This is kind of like a random game day, so this is actually a game jam game, meaning it was built in a very, very short time, the entire game. But it seems kind of like something that you guys would be interested in, and it's free, and it's also a browser game, so you don't even have to download anything, so it's really cool. So if you're interested in playing it after watching me play it, I'll leave a link down in the description. So, this is a game about building robots. Our job is to build an energy-efficient robot, drag and drop parts on the build area to create our robot. We can test it to make sure that it works, so then we can actually start the level to see if it, if it does what we're planning on it doing, I guess. So we have to complete the level before our power runs out, so it's all about creating efficient robots. Alright, so, I guess this is our level. Level 1, we have to get over to here, from over here. So these are our parts. We have left and right thrusters, we have upward thrusters, we have a booster, magnets, repellers, blasters, a saw, and a shrink ray. So this seems like it's gonna be pretty cool. So it looks like we don't, I don't really know what we're gonna need. Uh, it looks like we need at least thrusters, upwards thrusters and sideways thrusters. So let's go with that first. So we're gonna use upward movement over here, and we're gonna use left and right movement over here, I guess. Four out of 15 blocks used. I feel like that's, we could use a lot more, but let's see how few blocks we can use. Oh, actually, I guess, oh, we have some, some battery life stuff up here. Seven minutes? Is that like real time minutes? What if I add more? Ah, yeah, it changes if I add more, okay. I wonder if that is real time minutes though. All right, what, what does testing do? All right, we are now in test mode. Here are the controls. So apparently I could use arrow keys for, oh. Okay, so, both the left and right thrusters are both can turn left and right. So we don't, it doesn't really matter what side we put things on, it looks like. And then up. What? This is crazy. Like nothing is attached to any particular side, it just does its job and stays in close proximity, I guess, to the thing. All right. All right. Well, I think this might be good enough. We're going to go ahead and end test and begin the level. Here we go. All right. Power remaining in the top left over there. Press P to pause and retry. Oh, we killed the scientist. I'm sorry, man. <laughs> this is what happens when you create an intelligent robot. They come back to kill you. Oh, is that fire? Did we just let the scientist on fire? Oh, level complete. All right. Well, uh, that was easy. I'm assuming it's going to get much harder. 18 seconds. Oh, I could have done better than that. But we had plenty of power left, so that's good. All right, so this is our second level. It looks like we have to avoid the electricity. We go up. Wait, what? What are those? There's two bu- Oh, we gotta press buttons to do the electricity things, to uh, turn them off. Do we need to just use our weight? I think if we just use our weight, we should be able to just use the same design, right? Let's go ahead and let's just do this. Let's see if we can do it. All right, pretty good so far. We're gonna kill the scientist and boop. All right, I got rid of the- Oh. So these are pressure sensitive, they're not just push, they're not switches, they're like pressure buttons. Alright, let's move this, come on, move it, there we, there we go, and I'm gonna need magnets, yep, I'm gonna need magnets. Alright, now things are getting interesting, now things are getting really interesting, let's press P to retry. Alright, magnet picks up metal, so we'll use the magnet, wait, how do I, I guess we'll, where should I put the magnet? Should I put the- I guess I'll put the magnet over there? Yeah, that makes sense. Alright, magnet. Actually, we might need some more upwards thrusters now that I think about it. Let's put some upwards thrust like that. And we have some sideways thrusters. Alright, that should be good, I think. Test. How do we use the magnet? Shift. Okay, there we go. Shift to activate the magnet. End test. Begin. Alright. Now let's see how this thing does. Uh, come on. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Alright, magnet. Whoa! Oh, Alright, it picks up everything. I did- Oh, whoa. These magnets are making me automatically go- Wait, what? The magnet makes me go to the- Go to the side. When I press the magnet, I go to the side. Why is that happening? This is confusing. Come on. Come on. Get out of- Go. Get- Did it- 
All right, the magnet's pulling me. All right, wait, all right, there we go, there we go. There we go. All right. All right, here we are. Yeah, whoops, I killed that guy pretty bad. All right, tough thing about the magnets is uh, they attract everything indiscriminately, which makes sense, but it makes it very difficult for me to control this stuff. So how am I gonna get one thing on there, but another thing on here? All right, see, there's, there's one, that's good. But how do I get... It moves them both. Oh, wait, oh, I can get this one. There we go, if we take this one up. Oh, nope, 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 nope. All right, this way. Then get... Get on there! All right, I just gotta nudge it. I just gotta nudge it, ready? Huh. Seriously? Huh. Oh, that was good. That was good. That was some elite skills right there. All right, that's it. Okay. All right, magnets are definitely a lot harder than I expected them to be. Now I think those are real-time minutes. The whole seven minutes and five minutes for energy, that might be real-time minutes, because some of these might actually take a while. All right. Level three, I'll need a magnet. Did I not need a magnet for that level? What are you talking about here? All right, let me get a better understanding. Wait, why is it starting to- All right, that's the end. Wait, that was not a fly-through. This is the worst fly-through ever. I can't see what's over there. All right, well, we're going in blind. I didn't pay attention. All right, so I'm gonna need a magnet, so we're gonna do, uh, uh, I think we'll only do two for upwards movement, and we're gonna do more sideways movement, because sideways was a little bit finicky that time, using the magnets. All right, there we go, magnet. Oh, a repeller pushes objects away. Hmm. We want to use a repeller too? Nah, we only have battery life with abilities is three minutes. Let's just do it with this. We'll see how this works. All right, we can go up, so that's good. Barely though. We maybe should have had one more. Yep, you know what? We're gonna have at least one more. Yeah, we're gonna have three, three upwards thrusters. And we're gonna have four left and right. And then one magnet. All right, let's see how this does. There we go. Now we can go up really well. All right, sorry, Mr. Scientist. And magnets. All right, that worked. All right, now we need... Hmm, what does this button do? Apparently nothing. Do I need to put a box on it, or do I need something heavier? Oh, there we go. Wait, did that just stop the wall? I don't want to stop the wall. I think I want to go through here, right? Go, 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 go. All right, cool. That works. Now what do we got a big bang bang? Wait, what does bang bang mean? Is that an exploding box? Um, Wait, how come a scientist doesn't count? Why can't I use a scientist on the thing? All right, we're gonna have to get something else. But this is starting to feel- this level's feeling actually easier to deal with the magnets. Come on. Whoop, 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 whoop. Is it not heavy enough? Do we need bigger weights? We need something with bigger weight? How about the desk? All right, or maybe this thing. There we go. And are we done? We're done. Oh. All right, we did it. Next level. Oh boy. Crush, crush, crush. Level four. Um, I don't see any buttons. It seems like this is purely maneuverability. So I'm just going to go with upward movement. We're only going to do, yeah, we're going to do three upward movement and we're going to do a bunch of sideways. A bunch of sideways movements. There we go. Begin. Because we want to go really fast to the side. This isn't actually that fast. All right. Uh. Oh, sorry, scientist. Sorry, man. Oh, go, 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 go. All right, good. We got that. I saved the scientist, too. So he should be happy that I saved him. At least they're giving me thumbs up. They enc they're encouraging me. They're giving me the encouragement I need to get through these difficult moments in my robot life. All right, that one was easy. That one was super easy. All right, what's this? Fun with shrink rays. We need to use shrink rays now? I don't even know how a shrink ray works. Why do we need shrink rays, though? All right, I will do the same thing. Three upwards thrust, four sideways, and a shrink ray makes things smaller. How do we use a shrink ray? Control. All right, there we go. Control is for the shrink ray. What do I gotta shrink though? What's down here? One. What do I shrink? I can shrink the box. I don't see the point in shrinking the box though. Oh, I see. Oh, I need a magnet too. 
I need magnets because I gotta bring the rocks up here and I gotta drop it down after it's shrunk. Okay, magnet, shrink ray, up, 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 side, 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 side. Begin. All right, I think we got it. I think we got it. We're gonna magnet. We're gonna magnetize, and then. I guess we didn't need to shrink it. Did it work? That yeah, worked. What's the opposite of a shrink ray? A grow ray? Uh, but why? All right, I guess we'll bring this up with us. I think we need something else over. No, over here. Are you serious? <laughs> Get back up here. Come on. Come on. Okay, come on. Come on. Stay with me. Stay with me now. No, 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 stop pushing me. Stop it. Why did that just happen twice in a row? That uh, seems like an un unlikely series of events to happen two times in a row. All right. So the tough thing is that the magnet pulls something into you, which then pushes you more than you want to be pushed. So you got to be careful with your magnets. All right, is that going to work? That should work. But, oh, I see now. I see now. We need to push all of these buttons. We need to push all of these buttons in order to get to where we want to go. I didn't really see a point for the shrink ray yet, though. I mean, I didn't need the shrink ray to put that box down there, surprisingly. I think I just lucked out, maybe. And... Oh, oh, jeez! <laughs> uh, that doesn't make sense. That is not... That's not science. Fire doesn't... do that unless he's made of air. Alright, well, I'll take it. I'll take it for the hilarity. And you know what, just for fun? I'm just gonna do that. All right, 99 seconds. That feels good. Okay, laser target practice. What does that mean? What do we have to laser target practice? I guess we'll use a blaster. Let me do a fly flyby again. All right, I don't, oh, we need to use lasers for those probably. Do I need a magnet for anything? I'm gonna use a magnet. Yeah, we need, we have some switches. We have a switch. All right, magnet. We have a blaster. We have a magnet. We're gonna use some upwards. Propellant and some sideways propellant and one more upward. All right, this should be good. Begin. Oh wait, how do I use the magnet? Control. Okay. Pew pew pew. All right, sounds good. Pew 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 pew. Oh, I'm. So oh, he lost his limbs. Is that because of me? Oh no, nope, I guess it's because of those things. I'm sorry. Not really. I'm a robot. I don't have any feelings. I don't feel guilt. I do not feel guilt. You know what? I might need my magnet for this. Just gonna bring that off there. There we go. All right, and now we're gonna need our magnet for this thing. Oh, come on. No, stay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we might be stuck. We might be stuck. Don't, don't just get to, I don't know if boxes get destroyed. Uh-oh, this is bad. This is bad. Come on. I don't know how to bring it to that side. Come on, get underneath me. You know what? I got an idea. I got an idea. Oh, did you just see that? That was epic. That was epic. I am so proud of myself. That was cool. All right. Well, this seems interesting. Why is that? That scientist has chosen a bad spot to, uh, to oversee this trial here. But I think I got this. Yep. All right, I think I'm. I think I'm doing pretty well. I think I'm doing pretty well. What do we got here? We got a button, a big button. We got lasers. We got. We need a, 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 a shooty arrow, a shooty thingy. All right, so we need at least one projectile. Is it? Wait, did it say final stage? I think this might be the last stage. We got that projectile. We got upwards thrusters. We got sideways thrusters. We're gonna need a magnet. I haven't had a reason for the saw yet. Or the shrink ray, or the repeller. Maybe it's just because I was too good and didn't need to use them. I I, I made I made do with lesser materials. All right, I think we're good. Begin. All right, let's see. What do we get going on here now? No problem. Oh, I think I see what the problem is. I have to drag something all the way back here. Uh, yeah, here we go. Let me get that mouse out of the way. All right, uh, yeah, I just gotta drag this back over here. Come on. Come on, Mr. Box. 
Come on, miss. There you go. And up. There we go. Got to time it just right. All right, now... We gotta turn our... Wait, how do we get our gun on that side? Our gun is facing... Whoa! All right, this is actually... In order to get my gun to face to the right, I have to push my leftwards thrust, which isn't good. There we go. All right, that was, that was something. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Ugh. All right, I think that's good enough. Is it good enough? Please be good enough. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Come on, get through. Get through. You know what? Eh, there we go. We got it. Wait, what? Okay, I have time. All right, and go. Is that the end? Do we beat the game? Well done! You have completed the game. This was made in 72 hours for Ludum Dare. Thanks for playing. Well, that was actually kind of fun. But really quick though, I wanted to see what the, uh, what the repeller and the, the shrink ray, I want to have a little bit of fun with those in like a more sandboxy element if I can. All right, we're back at level one. I'm just going to put one of everything on here so that we can have a little fun. Well, not one of everything. I'm going to put enough of everything that it makes sense so that we can have a little fun with uh, some of the other items that we did not get to use. So we definitely didn't get to use a saw. We didn't get to use the shrink ray, really. We didn't get to use a repeller. We didn't get to use a booster. And, oh, we need some more sideways thrust to be sure. All right, now we have we have like literally a little bit of everything. Let's change this to be whatever that is. All right, begin. All right, so control. All right, is that the shrink ray? I think that's the shrink ray. Shrink ray. I didn't put a laser on here, oh well. Wait a minute, now I have a magnet and a repulsor at the same time. Oh, it looks like the magnet is for metal, but the repulsor affects non-metal items. That's interesting. See, the repulsor affects those things, but the magnet does not. All right, what can I shrink? All right, apparently I can shrink the movable items. Can I shrink a scientist? Can I shrink a scientist? Come on, get the sci- Oh! I shrank the scientist's head! That was not what I expected to happen. That is an awesome- I sh You can shrink their individual limbs! Look at that! You can just shrink the- You can shrink everything but their tor- Oh, I shrank the guy's head up here too. Alright, what about the saw? We're gonna run to this guy with a saw. Whoa! Alright, this is even more fun. This is more fun than, uh, than just playing it normally. <laughs> How about if we shrink the scientist? Oh, I accidentally beat the level. Oh, I didn't get to use my booster. Let's use a booster. All right, let's just use all boosters. I think if we press space, it uses the booster. Let's just see. Well, oh wait, no, we can't use all boosters. We have to have at least one rocket and one thruster to start. So we'll just use one, one rocket and one thruster and then all boosters. All right, there we go. Space to boost. First, let's get over the, come on. All right, apparently not. All right, ready? Here we go, we're gonna boost. Holy cow, that's what boosting does. Boost! <laughs> well, I beat the level. That was great. Okay, so that's all the items in the game. Uh, it's really interesting. I wonder how you would use some of those other items to help you. Oh, I see what the boosters are used for now. For those areas where I had to get through someplace really, really fast, obviously a booster would have been helpful. But uh, if you want to play the game, check the link down in the description. Let me know what you thought. I thought it'd be fun to just do kind of like a random one-off game this time rather than uh, one of my normal series games. So if you like this kind of thing, let me know down in the comments below. I'll try to look for more games that I think you guys would like on these uh, one-off kind of random days. Don't forget to check the links down in the description for other ways to interact with the channel. This has been Scrapman, and I'll see you next time. Bye.